today we are going to Sky Pond. How do we get across? You can jump right there. Are you crazy? Five in the morning, mountain climbing time. Yeah, they bring it back to me. You ready, bro? Let's do this. I'm super excited because this is the first time being in the Rockies. I'm here with these two amazing knuckleheads. <laughs> Wouldn't trade them for the world. Well, sometimes I want to trip them off a cliff. <laughs> but that usually passes after a little bit. Sky Pond Trail is located in the Rocky Mountain National Park. It's a 10 mile out and back trail that's rated difficult, but nevertheless, it's a popular trail as it features many beautiful scenic spots with mountain range views, waterfalls, and lakes. And our first one of these spots is just a mile into the trail at Alberta Falls. Now you don't have to go through this route exactly, you can see the falls just fine from the actual trail. But because it's me, this is like a playground for me, so I really can't help it but want to get up close. I have a problem. I can never see waterfalls from far away. It has to be right here or nothing. I burned all my energy in that. <laughs> well, gee, I wonder why. Yeah, it's all fun, but then I always end up like this. Now, this trail eventually gets to an elevation of almost 11,000 feet. The higher you go, the harder it is on your body. With any high altitude trail, it's good to take it nice and slow. Conserve your energy, which is what I kind of failed to do and later on paid the price for it. 
but more on that later. Of course, enjoy nature and have fun, but remember to know your limits. That is Alberta Falls on the trail on the way to Sky Pond. That's why this trail is so good. You get a little bit of everything. You get the waterfalls. We're gonna see some amazing huge lake scenery with mountains in the background, and then we'll actually get to Sky Pond. So this whole trail is like one full adventure. You know, it's not just one point that's awesome. It's the whole thing. Let's go. First few miles are fairly easy, nothing too strenuous with breathtaking views along the way. Just be careful with the chipmunks, they do like to steal food out of people's bags, they're little thieves. have made it to the lock. Once you make it to the lock veil, you're halfway there to the actual sky pond. But this spot itself is stunning and great for pictures and during summer, great for swimming. After you pass this is when the trail begins to get a little more difficult, so get ready. perfect because even if you don't want to go all the way to the end you still have a lot of areas that you can enjoy such as Alberta Falls and the Lock Vale but we are set and determined to make it to the very end to Sky Pond so onward we continue marching pretty epic <laughs> beautiful we're almost there we're almost there the lake we were at. We gotta go all the way to the top of that waterfall and climb over it. They say visiting Colorado is tough for people who aren't used to these high altitudes. We're definitely putting that to the test. <laughs> Altitude sickness is not a joke. I am officially jacked up. And my body just shut down. This is bananas. He's taking your backpack! He's taking your backpack! Let's climb this thing. Seguimos, si, paramos, no, seguimos, si, pero después de un break, después de un break, si, después de un break. 